The OHS data was wonderful for my research project because I was specifically interested in asking questions related to aging. And there was a cohort within OHS that used single cell RNA sequencing data that was specifically selected based on these age-related questions. And so it was a really great opportunity to utilize this data for my question looking at allele-specific expression with age. I'm Michelle Harwood, a recent PhD graduate, and my PhD research was focused on population genetics questions. I was interested in why individuals within a population may differ in their gene expression based on factors such as your ancestry, your environment, or your age. I would recommend using OHS data. I find it really wonderful, especially for some of these exploratory research questions. Sometimes in my research, I would come up with, uh, see an association or differences in individuals, and I, I couldn't figure out myself why that would be happening. But with so many different factors and variables, we can start to look into different environments. Are they smokers? Are they, do they, are they drinkers? Where are they located? Their pollution levels? Um, various factors like that or, or their diseases to see if this explains any of this variation that I see in my results.